I just want to say it first before the year end up. Um, I had a crazy ass dream that I call it the most high, I call it good energy, man. Bro, I don't, I ain't, I don't say I, I don't want, I don't got no more beef, argument, smoke, anger towards nobody, bro. If, if we ever had problems, beef, anything, I'm telling you right now, for me, bro, it's over. Like, I ain't talked to my best friend, my little brother, why almost a year? Oh, because we were stuck in ego and all shit, shit like that. Just because the industry changed us. Like, we were young niggas, man, with dreams, and we really succeeded. But this game changed us. And we finna take this shit back from the big homie, man. I'm telling y'all first. Hey, Gooch, nigga, let's sit, up, let's sit the fuck down, man. All that playing over with, man. You know how to get me, big dog. You call me. Nobody else. All right, Mr. Teleferro TV, how's everybody doing out there? I want to add what Gucci Man responded since they say I never give the news. Um, Gucci Man was on Streets 945. He's promoting his Evil Genius album. And he said, I reached out to Walker right after that interview. He was like, to be honest, with him going on the internet like that, I reached out because I thought it was urgent. I reached out because I wanted to know. So I called him and we had the conversation. And one of the personalities over at Streets 945, asked Gucci straight up and down are you guys cool now and, Gu and Gucci he didn't say we're cool now he said everything is in the past alright salute to Gucci for being a bigger person you know what this is I, I, I get it man Walker really wants to rekindle that old flame with Gucci Gucci's the one that helped put him in the game and I get it uh, Walker's mom Deb technically had a big impact on them being in the game but Gucci was the talent back in the day Walker was just a shooter on the road with Gucci. Then he became the rapper and through the uh, the freaking Salute Me or Shoot Me series, Walker became a big deal. Never was bigger than Gucci, but he was definitely a big deal down south for sure. Now, here's the thing. I think Gucci was checking on Walker because he's looking at it like, yo, this dude just went on the internet, you know, speaking on my name. It's on all the blog sites and all that, reaching out for help. He was thinking something was wrong, like something we need to get on the phone and talk about something. And... If he probably got on the phone walking and realized, oh, he just wanted to talk. Ain't nothing wrong with that, bro. That happens all the time in relationships where one of the people over-exaggerates over something that really wasn't that big of a deal just to talk to the other person and kind of thin the ice and kind of try to get everything back, thing back cordial. Because remember, Gucci a few times since he's been home from, from prison, he was like, look, if you were in my life in the past, I'm done with you. It ain't no hard feelings. Ain't no beef. I'm just not rekilling any old flames. So Gucci even going and, and reaching out and calling Waka is probably something that he didn't even think in the wildest of dreams that he would be doing at this point in his life because he's just on a, a, an entirely different wave right now. He's on positive Gucci wave. He the hood LeBron. All right, this nigga hoop. He got a six pack. Uh, dude looks like he's in phenomenal shape. Living his best life out here. He's married. Salute to Gucci. He on a positive wave. And, and salute to Waka as well. Waka's on a positive wave. Got his gal. You know, and he said he's really not the artist that's going to be just making those petty, childish type raps anymore. Pretty much Walk is only, he's pretty only much rapping his catalog with colleges, right? He's become like a college touring act every year. They're both grown and mature. I would personally love to hear some music from Walk and Gucci. That's just me being selfish. But let's call it what it is. It ain't going to sound the same because when they make records, like Gucci's Evil Genius album, I like it. I, I like it. Walker's last project that he put out. I like it. But it ain't the same. It ain't the same era, in my opinion. Music doesn't have the same impact um, like it did a few years ago. I still personally would like to hear these two people get together and make music, but it's just for selfish reasons, just because it takes me back like eight, nine years ago when these two used to do a lot of more music together. Uh, that's all. I, I hope they do come together, and maybe Walker could come out on one of Gucci's sets, right? That'd be dope. To see them do a set together in Atlanta somewhere, that would be great for the culture. But other than that, I mean, I think Gucci literally, I mean, Gucci's a pretty honest dude. He's a pretty thorough dude. I met Gucci once. We uh, we were both, both born legendary on the 12th of February. Gucci pretty much said, I reached out to Walker because I thought something was wrong. All right? When he posted that video on the gram, I'm thinking something wrong, something happened. 
but that was just Waka playing the role of the chick who randomly texts the guy and you know she hits the guy with hey can you help me move something y'all all been there when the chick randomly hits you up fellas and she like yo I need help moving something could you help me out and and you know you know you gotta come through and you know it's never just you helping her out move furniture you damn near moving something else all right and on the other end with ladies y'all know fellas do it all the time they try to find a way on the holidays and fellas let's, let's not lie like we don't do it on the holidays we we be quick to send out them happy new year texts with some of the old flames for no damn reason right just trying to see if we can sneak back in yeah, you know I mean, start the new year all right. Send out, send out that Merry Christmas text. Y'all gonna be sending them out in a couple weeks. It, it's just that. That's what it was. All right, nothing more, nothing less. And Gucci bit, by the way. And, and he got on the phone with Walker. And I'm happy to hear that these two people who had a very public feud when they were both in different spaces, public feuds over. Salute the Gucci and Walker. What up, ten seventeen? Thank y'all so much for the time, love, and support. I don't take it for granted. Would y'all be here for a Gucci and Waka uh, record or two? Or would you more or less uh, see them? want to see them on stage performing? Or what would you want to see, if anything at all, from the two together musically? Come out. I hate to interrupt the video, but I got a gift for you. See, I know a lot of people just be scheming through the videos. They don't really be watching the whole video. But we're going to start to catch them fake pharaohs now. The whole month of December, I got Amazon gift cards on deck. And I'm going to just be randomly giving them away, like right now all right so the amazon code that's flying across your screen right now it's yours the first person to redeem it have whatever the amount is i think i got some ten dollar ones twenty five dollar ones fifty dollar ones a hundred dollar ones as well in the mix so this gift card is yours i hope you win it uh, i hope you watch this video all the way through we gonna randomly drop these little videos in the midst of my videos the whole month of december so we gonna catch all these fake pharaohs who ain't watching my videos all the way through just a small token of my appreciation for you and being a subscriber of my platform so good luck i hope you won that gift card if you won it comment in the comment box below say you won it we're gonna keep doing this all month for the real pharaohs happy holidays from yours truly mr tell pharaoh enjoy the rest of the video christmas just ain't christmas Without the one you love. Oh, yo, where y'all come from? What's going on? This yours truly invest the Delaferro. And it is the holiday season, and I'm in the giving mood. To be honest with y'all, y'all gave me over 60 million views this year. So give your darn self a pat on the back. Thank y'all so much for all the love y'all showed me. And I gotta give back. Yeah, it's time to give y'all some of this energy that y'all been giving me in 2018. So I'm doing a giveaway. And guess what? anyone's eligible to win some of this free stuff all right it's just that simple there are no specific groups no hidden no you can get this free stuff too bruh i got a playstation in my lap i actually got a couple playstations i got all the games i got a couple copies of all the games we got all the hot games i got some amazon gift cards to my side i got a, a tv or two maybe as well to give away so this is my time to give you guys some love back Thank y'all so much for y'all for y'all for y'all been showing me all year long. Now, here are the three simple things you gotta do to win this stuff. All right, you know there gotta be some rules. I just can't give this stuff away. I mean, I did pay for it. Number one, you gotta be subscribed to my YouTube's. It's Mr. Teller Ferro and Ferro Reacts. You gotta be subscribed to the sports one as well to be in the running. We gonna fact check. We gonna make sure y'all show us some screenshots of y'all subscriptions. All right. Number two, you gotta be following my instagram account mr teleferro tv we got sports hip-hop news every day on that bad boy number three you can't just follow the account you gotta show some love to my instagram make sure you like five posts after you do those three things we're gonna randomly pick winners from instagram all right we're gonna randomly pick people who didn't like five posts on my instagram and we're gonna hit you up and be like yo send me a screenshot of you subscribe to my youtube's Send me a screenshot of you following my Instagram, and we're going to go from there. We're going to pick random winners. I got somebody working on that during this holiday season. But yes, you can win some of this free stuff. I want to help some of these parents make their Christmas morning special for their kids. Kids, y'all can y'all eligible as well. Y'all can get in the running for this free stuff. Make sure y'all do those three steps, and some of this giveaway season glory will be yours. 
Christmas just ain't Christmas without the one you love. Happy holidays from yours truly, Mr. Telefero.